Thousands of people are still without power as we come to you right now, live at 603. In Atala County, this strong winds knocked down those trees and power lines. WTVA's Chris Knowles, he is live in Kosciuszko tonight. He joins us with the latest. Yeah, right now I'm here in Kosciuszko right off of Coleman Street. Now, you can see this down power line right here as well as some cones. They've actually put these cones up here to prevent people from coming down this street. Well, there are a lot of people here without power. This one lady I talked to earlier, she told me that this is going on six days since her and her four children have been without power. EMA Director Danny Townsend says as this morning, as of this morning, 1,200 energy customers are without power and around 22 central electric customers are without power. He says it started Wednesday, June 14th. Many of those have not had power since then. I talked to two victims, one resident. She tells me she works from home and she risked losing her job due to not being able to work. Another lady says she has four kids and she had to send them to other relatives so they would not suffer. Um, so I work from home four days out the week. I thought I could lose my job. Um, definitely because we had a couple of deliverables that I needed to get done this week. And with the power went out, I wasn't able to meet those um, deadlines. And it's very much an inconvenience on how I deal with everyday life. We've got four kids. We've got family that still had power. And each of them have, you know, decided that they'll take on a child. And we just didn't want them suffering without the air conditioner. So. We are living out of our little utility shed in the yard. Halderman says she lost many groceries from the outage. Now, I did ask the EMA director, Danny Townsend, about the en energy's response. He told me that, you know, that they're, are, they're trying to get things back on. But, you know, I told him, I said, this is 2023. These people been, have been without power for nearly a week now. What's, what's happening? What's the holdup? And he said, you know, the storms that came through last night really put a damper in their progress that they were trying to have to get things back on for these folks today. Right now, I'm here in Atala County, Kosciuszko. Chris Knowles, WTVA 9 News.